What is up, guys? Welcome to a brand new series about the new expansion, City Living. If you guys don't already know me, my name is Josh. At first off, I wanna welcome all the new viewers and everybody. If you are an old viewer or a person just coming back, welcome back to my channel. I apologize, I haven't posted in a while, but let's not discuss that now. Let's just jump into the series. So what we're doing today is we will be working with the political career. Throughout this series, I'd like to climb up to the top of the political ladder. I'd also like to build up a following, make money if I choose fundraiser, get votes if I choose the presidential side. At level five in the political career, you get picked between fundraiser or I believe it is a politician. If you guys have an opinion on which one you'd like me to be, feel free to ask. I just started to mess around and dabble with City Livings, so I'll introduce a few of the new content they've added in the Creator Sim, and in future episodes we'll check out the items and so forth. This is also my first playthrough on YouTube of City Livings, so we'll probably be, it'll also be a tutorial for the, for the new expansion. I first off wanna say that it is awesome how much content they added with the expansion. I played it on stream for a couple hours and it is unbelievable. The amount of design and effort they put into this expansion pack in comparison to the other ones is like just uncomparable to the past ones. For example, the get to work, you can completely avoid the completely avoid the groups they weren't necessary you know but with this one i feel like it's so in your face just everything they've implemented all the new stuff the festivals and so forth with it they added a bunch of new clothes so what i'm currently rocking is a brand new like bomber outfit it's the leather jacket on top of the sweatshirt but they also added all this stuff if i can find it they added all these cool sweaters and cool designs that are currently very popular and like trendy uh like you got this crazy one they also add this brand new tattoo which i added on my guy i figured if he's a politician he can hide him underneath his sleeves if he's an activist and a fundraising expert who the heck cares you know he also is rocking a brand new hairstyle provided with the new city livings the man bun probably a long request i could believe it's been so popular Especially, and then you got like the Fabio hair, which is very popular as well right now. Very cool. I think those might be the only two hairstyles that they added with this one for men. Oh, no, they added more. Here, here's one. Here's another one. I actually really like this one too. I feel like my twin brother has this hair. But they've added a lot in that. So they've added these cool, like kind of important hairstyles. I think the man bun's almost a necessity at this point. It's so iconic. They only added goatee for facial hair. They added a bunch of cool new outfits though. So let's just check those out right quick. I actually love the leather jacket. That's what we'll be rocking, the black leather jacket. But they added like this cardigan, which is very nice. As you see, very designy, all up in your face. They added the tank. Up here, I believe. Nope, I'm sorry. And the full body, they added some really cool ones. Like some very different ones that are quite interesting they added this which is very like i think it's for the festivals that's what i think it's for i couldn't imagine you wear it for anything else um they had this outfit which is like just so in your face i think it'd be very nice and formal wear they added a little apron because they added food carts with the new expansion so that's gonna be interesting maybe we'll check those out out of this superhero costume they made a bear which i'm most excited about to be honest um down here i think where is it there was this one outfit that i loved it's a long this no that's not it you kind of look like a vampire there this one it just screams like modern i just feel like it's so trendy and so popular like the h m look the extra long look i'm like a huge fan of it and each one has like a different design slightly. You got like some crazy as techie designs and stuff. It's just so cool. But anyways, we're gonna keep the outfit I already picked out. Not the bear, I wish. This outfit was the one I really like. I love the jacket, the sweatshirt with the leather jacket. We're wearing just a normal pair of ripped jeans and some shoes. By the way, this is David Bernard. Just a random name. 
Um, for his formal wear, it's a little dressy, but not too much. I figured it could go either way. I'm kind of leaning towards fundraiser, but whatever you guys say in chat will, in chat, whatever you guys say in the comments will probably define his future. So there's his, um, his formal wear. It's a little dressy. It's not too much right now. If he cruises through the political career, we'll change it up because you get cool suits and new jackets and stuff and some cool political clothing. His athletic career is just this. It's nothing special. Um, I'll actually throw him in this just because they added it. Actually, I really like this one. I'll throw him in that. Reminds me of like a, uh, a jersey, a band jersey. They've been making those, which is kind of cool. Uh, sleepwear, just your normal t-shirt and pants. And then his party wear, it's still formal, still dressy, kind of fun. But I think it's a little edgy, so I like that. And last but not least, we got the uh, the swimwear, just normal trunks. Anyways, this is David Bernard with the expansion they added this brand new uh, aspiration. I'm not 100% sure what I need to accomplish while doing this, but I figured it'd be fun. Try out the new expansion completely. So we have the, um, I don't even know what it's called. The city native, the sim is all about the city life. It came with the expansion is all about sea life and he gets, becomes happier when he is in their home neighborhoods. Kind of like in your home city. If you're from Boston, you probably like to be in Boston. Same with New York, you probably like to be in New York City. His other aspirations, just to highlight the new ones real <laughs> fast. They added unflirty, which is the opposite of flirty. Kind of interesting. They also added, uh, I think Squeamish is new. I could be wrong, but I believe scream, Squeamish is new. And then they added Vegetarian. So they added this cool new Vegetarian trait for the Sims where you can only be a Vegetarian. Like, like uh, these Sims will actively avoid eating food that contains meat products and be can become sick if they eat such foods. That's kind of interesting. They didn't add anything else. So talking about the character now, this is David Bernard. He is outgoing, very friendly. I gave him the creative trait because there's some interesting morals, 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 can't pronounce words, things you can spray on the ground. So they have these spray paint things that used to be in like Sims 3 where you can vandalize areas, except now it's like a ground painting that's supposed to persuade a point. So I figure we might be able to do something with that if he's a creative and he does a little bit of painting. And the last one's a goofball. I figured he could be a little bit more fun. Maybe he's like the more fun politician, kind of entertaining, kind of fun to watch instead of boring. Um, and that is what David Barnard, Bernard is. That is who he is. He's a energetic, friendly guy, a little goofball and creative. Throughout the series, I just want to try and boost him through the political career. I believe, and I'm comp I'm kind of up in the air if you guys want me to do it, I might be running a counterpart series at the same time, so maybe every other day or something, with the either critic or social media career. I haven't touched either of those at all yet. The game just came out today, so I haven't really had time, but hopefully we'll be able to mess around and dabble in those too. I want to thank everyone for watching. If you guys are interested, you can look below and hit that follow button subscribe button there we go or hit that follow button on twitch twitter and i think that's all i got down there if you have any questions comments concerns if you're just freaking excited leave a comment down below give me something to do when i'm sitting in class bored as hell i'll respond to your beautiful comments thank you everyone for watching i really appreciate it i'll catch you on next episode good night everybody